Hello everyone, and welcome back to probably one of my final videos that I ever get inspiration to do. I made this because of recent drama between the commentary world of the download. Sound weird, I know, but that's what some commentary YouTubers have been calling it. The people who have inspired me to make this video are Pendrix, Warren, and the new guy, who I haven't seen before, Vault. Today, we're here to talk about why commentary YouTubers are going to fall. First point, commentary is starting to get boring. It's getting really repetitive, all it's done is exposing and using cancel culture to their advantage to try and get kick out of people. Most commentary YouTubers get an average of 400 views to 18,000 views, while people who actually do their job trying to expose people, et uh, pedophiles or zoophiles or just horrible people in general, they get paid for it as it is a job. It's called the police, as well as the FBI, the CIA, and any other international group. The basis of small commentary YouTubers' points of why they do commentary is to try and help the community. Despite the fact that they use this just to make their selves look like the good guy. When in reality, this is just the kid version of politics. Now, no one seems to understand that commentary is starting to die. You can see this because despite Vault, for example, and Warren, they are no longer getting as many views as they used to. Their view counts are dropping, their sub counts are dropping, dropping as in they're not getting as much as they used to. Now. Very known YouTubers that have done this, especially controversial ones like Warren, Parlo, Mythical, Pendrix, all of them are kind of the reason why commentary is dying. I know there are hundreds of other YouTubers, some that may have millions of subscribers, and I may not even know that. But point is, commentary is dead and it's going to stay that way for a long time unless new content can be made commentary isn't just about going to expose people or talking about people commentary is in the name itself for example gaming commentary while gaming commentary while doing IRL streams you get the point most commentary YouTubers only do exposed videos or drama videos because that's what's uh, relevant in the current community. So, the reason commentary is dying is not because commentary YouTubers are making commentary, it's that they're not. They call themselves commentary YouTubers when in reality they do political videos, nothing else. That is my small rant for this video. I hope you can understand my points and why I think commentary YouTubers are not going to be as big as in the future as they are now. Goodbye.